We'll finish what my father couldn't. We'll awaken Ansur, the heart of the gate. I disappointed him once. I won't do it again. I do, and so does my father. Go on, read the legend of Ansur. Then we can plan our next steps. Welcome, dear patron, to the floor at the top of the stairs. If you have information about the Night Song, great riches await. If you are here to waste the great wizard Laroican's time, reconsider. Let your knowledge determine your path forward. Don't 
Gale, isn't he? This is just his sort of... Welcome, dear patron, to the floor at the top of the stairs. If you have information about the night song, great riches await. If you are here to waste the great wizard Laroican's time, reconsider. Let your knowledge determine your path forward. Claw. Uh, Craig's aim is much improved, but uh, still leaves something up to chance. Yes, sir. All right, Crank. Ready? Aim. Oh. Hmm. We have a visitor. That is, McClaw, you may go. I see no night song. Uh, surely you wouldn't have entered my tower without the night song in hand? Surely you wouldn't have wasted my time? You'll have more gratitude than you know how to count once the night song is in my hands. Do you have it or not? Uh, explain yourself. meant to be some consolation she it was the key to my immortality how can this be how can this be Shit! Oh. Mother's milk, your visage speaks of ill tidings. Speak, ally mine. What troubles you? Is he indeed? Pray tell, what does he seek from Dame Aelin? <sighs> Magicians and their machinations. I have had enough for an eternity. I will wring his neck. Until he's dead. <laughs> the weasel outweaseled. Well done, my friend. But Dame Aelin's deeds are great. Her presence, present. 
Sooner or later, he will discover that the daughter of Saluna lives. Let us travel to his chambers, his lair. We will see him undone, in the style of the dead, unburied Ketherick Thorn. I'm coming with you. I'd like to get a few licks in myself. My darling, we agreed you'd scout for the nearest Salunite enclave this very night. Let us divide our efforts, all the sooner to be reunited. I won't let you go alone. Who knows what this wizard might have planned? Our closest ally will accompany me, won't you? It will be a swift and fruitful chore. Hie we to this Laroican right away. I am as eager to meet him as he is to ensnare me. Magician in a tower, hiding away from the frightening world. What are you so scared of, Magus? Not the Night Song, surely? Why, she's nothing but a relic to be purchased and pursued. My God, the Night Song is a person. Uh, by my honor, it's you. My dear, I thought you were. You will address me with due deference. I am Dame Aelin. And you are a whelp without honor, without pride, with nothing but a tower full of trinkets. Oh, my apologies, Dame Aelin. I meant no disrespect. I asked our mutual friend here to make an introduction that I might get to meet the famed daughter of Saluna. Forgive me for that impudence. Perhaps our friend can bridge the gap and do what I believe they came here to do? My steel-hearted friend speaks true. Give me one good reason, Magus. Why I should not strike you down where you stand. <sighs> Dame Aelin, I have discovered a device that would allow your immortality to be shared. It would cause you no harm, no pain of any kind. You serve your mother, Saluna, I believe. She who has blessed our realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. You dare to threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years! You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. A pity you didn't prove a more reliable ally. You could reap the rewards of my good favor. I'd hoped you'd keep an open mind, but it seems you're determined to make this as difficult as possible. Boy, at the ready. Once I've taken control of the Asima, she must go directly into the caging runes. No, Master Lerorkin. I would never have assisted you if I knew you planned such horrors. You lied to get the Night Song here. Made us all believe she was nothing but a relic. I have seen what true leadership can accomplish, but never under your tutelage. Watch your tongue, you child. I 
could make it such that no wizard in the realm will touch you. If they're all like you, I think that sounds like an excellent bargain. <laughs> oh, face us, charlatan! We who detest you so! Mamadons! Imperatum! Enjoy this. Shall we cut and run? Sounds like fun.
still breathing, despite everything. easy these days.
Roacan. You who would see me caged. You who would purchase my submission with profane gold. Let every wicked magus, every vile murtherer, each slaver and misery merchant see. Dame Aelin is watching. She is indomitable. And when her face lights the shadows of your wrongdoing, you are broken by its beauty! The Firehead Fool is dead. Yet as I stare upon his corpse, I feel... sadness. Why? A gripping in the chest, as though I'd lost someone. Something. Uh, uh, Paladin's fatigue, no doubt. You were excellent in battle, as is your way. And I am proud to fight at your side. And you, tiefling, you did not embarrass yourself. I will catch my breath, then to camp I will bring my bones. Moon Maiden be with you. Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? The Roakan is dead! The bastard is dead! I am. Now that the bastard's in bits. The Roakan was a cruel and vicious man. By day, I'd tend the shop, but at night, he'd fire the most nonsensical questions at me. And for every one I answered wrong, he'd beat me. I could have killed him with my own two hands. But I kept thinking it was all a test. It had to be. I thought it was the price I had to pay to become a true wizard. I realize now he was just a sick, sick. I see things clearly now. If I wish to master the weave, I must do it myself. Thankfully, I have everything I need right here. <laughs> so... Oh, I like the sound of that. I do indeed. I'll move Cal and Leah in immediately. The Roakin refused to let them stay here. They are gonna love the tower. I wouldn't have this, the tower, my family, without you. What can I do to thank you? And you'll have me. I'll learn everything I can about the tower in the meantime even if I have to rip this place apart. But know this, Ramazith's tower and its master are now your friends. And when the time comes, we will stand by you as allies. <laughs> <laughs>